man who invented cement was a genius. Without cement, there would be no modern cities. So what is cement and how did it come about? In fact, cement is a building material made from a mixture of materials including limestone, clay, and iron ore. These raw materials are extracted by blasting in quarries and then transported to the production site by trucks. Then they are mixed according to a certain ratio and crushed by a crusher into small uniform pieces. The rough gravel is then transported and stacked in storage warehouses. At this point, if the proportion of material is not up to standard, some corrective material can be added. The compliant mix is then transported to a grinding mill, where it is ground into a fine powder. This is the so-called raw material. The raw meal is then transferred to an emergency silo for thorough mixing. After mixing, the raw meal is heated to 850 degrees Celsius in a preheating tower, utilizing the boiling heat from the raw meal. It is heated in a series of cyclones and then fed into a rotary kiln. It is further heated in a rotary kiln at up to 150 degrees Celsius, where the combustion flame can reach temperatures of up to 2000 degrees Celsius. During this process, the raw meal reacts with additives to form small particles of clinker. This process is called sintering. The clinker then enters a cooler, where it is rapidly cooled to about 100 degrees Celsius. It is then transported to the storage silo. Finally, the clinker is transferred to the cement mill for grinding into powder. At this point, gypsum is also added to the clinker, mainly to regulate the setting time and hardening properties of the cement. After the clinker and gypsum have been mixed and ground in the mill, they are filtered through a separator to remove the large particles and become the cement as we know it. In practice, the hydration reaction occurs after the cement is mixed with water and a hardened and solid cement will be formed. Okay, have you learned it now?